they spent two games trying to bait him. Sabonis over and over. You go back to the end of game one. He pulls down Draymond Green on the defensive rebound. They go down. Wiggins misses the potential game winner. I watched that clip five times yesterday from three different angles. Not only does he pull him down, as Draymond's trying to get up, he reaches around and grabs his chest so he can't run down the court. Mm. Earlier in the fourth, Draymond gets a defensive rebound, makes the outlet pass. Sabonis elbows him as he's running by and then flops to the ground. And if we have an alternate angle, I don't know if we do, of the play, it's very clear that Sabonis grabs Klay Thompson, tries to rip him down to the ground to draw a foul, and flops and ends up at Draymond's ankle and then makes a dirty basketball play. That is a non-basketball play to grab someone's ankle. Malik Monk did it to Draymond. This was, I, I believe, part of the strategy. I'm not saying Sabonis is a dirty player, but there's some dirty plays here. Okay. There is some dirty plays. For the league to acknowledge that Draymond served a punishment, he got ejected, which I believe he should have been ejected, and I'm not condoning what he did. Yes. He served his punishment. The Warriors today. believe he should have been ejected. They don't have a problem with it. Nobody has a problem with that. No, but that's important context that you're giving to the conversation. <laughs> and, and, I, and, and I haven't heard anybody talk about and, it. And I want to say something to you, too, because I agree that the Warriors can come back and win the next two games. To me, the referees have dictated too much in this series. They have allowed too much. I have no problem with physical play in the playoffs. But if Steph Curry's not allowed to move off the ball, if you're preventing players from running down the court and you're allowing that to happen – there's a play uh, late, late in game two where Kevon Looney's right underneath the rim, ready for a rebound. Sabonis crashes in, pushes him in the back. They don't call the foul. That's a foul. The referees have dictated too much in the Kings' favor in this series. I really believe that. And I don't know if it's the home crowd or whatever. I rarely complain about the referees. In fact, I don't even know if I've ever complained about the referees. I think they're great. But if they're going to come back in this series, they've got to call the game the way the game is supposed to be called. I really believe that. And they're not doing it, like you said, they're not calling the game the way that the game is supposed to be.